What is up guys, it's Ashton here, and um, pretty much I'm going to be telling you guys about the first time I ever did any psychedelic whatsoever, and it wasn't necessarily a good experience, it was kind of like, it was kind of a shitty experience to be honest, but it was worth doing because it kind of got me ready for, you know, the other psychedelics I've done and the other things that I've done so far, which I'll tell you guys in later stories, but basically... Uh, the first psychedelic I've ever done from the title, as you'll tell, is uh, Morning Glory Seeds. And pretty much what they are is they're these seeds that have... Uh, I'm not too sure what it's called, but I know it's like something... It's not exactly like what acid and all that has in them, but it's like some type of... I don't know. I don't, I don't, know, what, I don't know anything about them, to be honest with you. I just kind of trusted my friends, and they said, you know, we can trip off of these. And, you know, we could have gotten acid, but like we weren't really ready for it i don't think well i mean we probably would have done it but i don't think we went through the trouble of getting it yet so pretty much we just kind of you can buy these seeds legally by the way like they're legal so you don't have to you know do it illegally it's legal to do oh i don't know if it's rec recreationally legal i don't even know if people know that you can trip off of these because you know i haven't seen anyone i haven't seen many videos on it at least but um so yeah, uh, by the way, don't, you know, do these seeds or do any drug, actually, because of what I'm telling you guys. This is just me telling you guys a story of what I've done, and um, just for entertainment, it's not, you know, trying to provoke anyone to do these things. But uh, anyways, we were, I don't remember, like, the specifics, it was a while ago, and it was like, you know some sometime last year it was in the summer and uh we went to my friend uh my friend's house and we this this my this friend's house he always has like a f like open house like his parents are there but they really don't care um so we just can do like whenever like whenever we would want to do something that's where we would go like any type of drug like we would smoke weed there all the time and you know it was a fun experience it was like a fun place to be, a fun place to, you know, hang out and not have to worry about anything, don't have to get paranoid, but, um, so I went to his house, and to, to get, like, the tr to trip off of these seeds, you have to eat a shit ton of them, like, I think we ate somewhere around, like, 250, somewhere between 250 to 350, maybe even 400, I'm not 100% sure, but, um, that was, they taste disgusting, like, if you've, if you've ever done shrooms, it kind of tastes like shrooms, but, like, not as bad, I guess. Like, I don't know. It's, like, it's it tastes somewhat the same. It's not terrible, but then again, it's not good. And you have to eat a bunch of them, so that's the only reason it's bad. Like, if you only had to eat, like, five of them, then it would be fine. It wouldn't be too difficult. But, um, you know, we did that. We ate them. We, we, like, sat there counting them out for ourselves. And, like, we were just sitting there for, like, a long time uh, counting these seeds out. And uh, eventually it was time for me to eat them after I counted all mine out and stuff. And uh, I almost threw up a few times and I ended up just shoving all of them into my mouth and just chewing it up because I was tired of just tasting that taste over and over and over, like taking them like by fives. So I just ate all of them at one time and they tasted like shit. Like it was disgusting, like absolutely disgusting. Like if I, like, if I even taste anything remotely near that, I, it makes me want to throw up because I had these like guacamole takis and they tasted exactly the same and it was disgusting. Like I, I wanted to throw up. It's like I have PTSD to that flavor. But um, so yeah, we we ate those and I, I don't know exactly how long it took to kick in. It was like around 30 minutes or so, and uh, or it might have been 30 minutes to an hour. And all I like, it was kind of shitty because the nausea was terrible because. Like, most people, when they, um, eat these seeds, they just, you know, or they don't eat them, they, you know, put them in water and let them soak in the water or something like that, and let it just dissolve, so you, like, you don't have to eat them and get the nausea, but we just, we didn't feel like going through all that, because it takes a few days, or maybe just a day or so. Actually, I think it takes two days, two nights, so that's that, and we didn't feel like waiting that long, because it was like, you know, we, I don't know, we just wanted to do it then, I guess, and... So, you know, that was, it. like, at first, it wasn't bad, but then the nausea just got worse and worse and worse, and my other friends, like, there was four of us there, four or five, and there's four, there's four, 
and my other friend, he he was like not having any nausea, and pretty much the rest of us were just like sitting there laying down and like just like I felt like I was gonna throw up at any minute. I never did throw up, but I felt like I was the whole time pretty much. And um, we were just chilling in his house, and then it hit me, and uh, I wasn't really tripping like if you've done acid before you would definitely know what tripping is but it was kind of like kind of like you microdosed a little bit like it wasn't anything insane like you don't see crazy like you don't see de deer running across your house or anything like that but you just see like just like patterns and distortions and all that and it, it's it was fun doing I, I i don't think i'd do it again well, not eating them at least. Like I, I might be able to like, I might do it if like, I don't know if, I don't know. I might drink them like, like you're supposed to, but, <clears throat> but uh, yeah. So I was starting to feel it, and I was in my friend's room, and then me and my other friend, we went up to the living room and we just started eating Doritos. And I don't know if any of you have had nausea from Sykes before, but you're not like if you have nausea you're not really supposed to eat more that doesn't make any sense but you know we just kept on eating so yeah we um after it started hitting us a little bit we were you know having a good time just chilling out and we were i was feeling so nauseous like the whole time i just felt completely nauseous and it was it was worth doing i would say but i wouldn't tell anyone to go out and do it because it's not really anything too crazy and unless you do a lot then it's not going to even be worth it really because pretty much after the nausea went away um we pretty much got kicked out of that friend's house by his mom because it was late and i went to my friend's thailand's house and i could not talk to his grandma and i ended up, we ended up going back to my house after that and then we just kind of watched final destination and vaped or something and then went to sleep but yeah that's pretty much all the story guys um thank you guys for watching uh, you know, leave some suggestions in the comments what you guys want to see. I'm probably going to tell some more stories. I have a good amount of them. Uh, I might, you know, try to do a QA and a eventually as well. That sounds good to me. And uh, so, guys, make sure you like the video and subscribe. And uh, leave a comment. It would help a lot so I can, like, you know, base off of that. See you guys. Peace.